In just a few hours, we'll learn whether or not a judge will accept convicted killer Alec Murdoch's plea agreement in connection to his more than 100 financial state-level crimes. The former attorney will be back in a Beaufort County courtroom at 10 o'clock this morning, and Fox Carolina's Grace Runkle is here to tell us what we can expect. Mm -hmm. Alec Murdoch back in court today, this time to answer for his state level financial crimes. Chief Prosecutor Creighton Water says that today will allow for finality for the victims that the former lawyer stole millions from. Murdoch's plea deal whittles down more than 100 crimes to 22 guilty pleas to counts that include breach of trust, money laundering, and computer crimes. Today, Judge Clifton Newman will decide whether or not he accepts the plea deal Murdoch has with the Attorney General's office. If Newman agrees, Murdoch will serve 27 years in a state prison. If he doesn't, the deal gets thrown out. Water says the state is happy with the deal that's been worked out. Uh, what we've endeavored to do with this plea is to bring some finality uh, to this matter, uh, but to also ensure that there's an appropriate sentence, uh, a lengthy sentence that ensures that Mr. Murdoch uh, will remain in state prison uh, for a very long time. We're also expecting to hear from some of the victims involved in these crimes. They include Murdoch's former clients, even his law firm, and family friends. In Beaufort, Grace Runkle, Fox Carolina News. Well, Fox Carolina will be in that courtroom and we will have live updates as this hearing gets underway this morning. You can also get updates on FoxCarolina.com and inside of the Fox Carolina News app to download. Just scan the QR code on your screen or you can search for Fox Carolina in the App Store or Google Play.